Hi, this is Ronnie Smith. I'm coming to you from Mableton, Georgia. This is a video I'm shooting for the Intel Inspire project in terms of what inspires me. And this is the jar that I received uh, in the mail. It was very interesting. And what I've placed in the jar is what uh, we know as water, but today I'm calling it liquid light because light means knowledge and light is something that we're able to uh, see through and the people that have, have inspired me the most were the people that were able to see through uh, my life and not only my past my present but my future to know where I was going what I was trying to accomplish and these people were able to find that right key uh, that right way of teaching and the things that would would drive me most not just from their own words but they knew how to inspire me from within. And whenever you're inspiring someone from within, that person is able to move forward even though the teacher may no longer be around. I have uh, many teachers and mentors in my past that I do not see on an everyday basis, but what they were able to accomplish within that period of time in my life is something that I will never forget. And it puts you really on autopilot, it makes you uh, be enthusiastic, be excited about what you're doing, and most of all, uh, that enthusiasm, that passion comes through everything that you're doing. Uh, you're trying to do it to your best abilities, but at the same time, uh, you're never forgetting that that teacher did make uh, an impression upon you that time will not erase. And even when I'm trying to record music, uh, inspiration may just come from uh, a rhythm that you hear in nature, the way someone may say something, um, just the just the language itself sometimes has its own rhythm patterns within. And so whenever you're dealing with something, it's not always something that has to come from the outside, but when we're allowing that creativity to flow through from the inside. And so back to this liquid light, whenever we have something, that uh, we can see through, uh, it fills the form of whatever it is of the container and something like this, um, it is inspirational. And it is something that we, we owe each other, we owe each other as mankind, but most of all, we owe ourselves and as well as our teachers and our mentors uh, to give their lives meaning and fulfill their legacy by living our lives as best as we can do. And again, this is Ronnie Smith coming to you from Mableton. Uh, yes, I am highly inspired, and I hope that you are inspired as well.